What's going on my YouTube family? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. I know I've been gone for a while, but I'm back. Today we're gonna to be reviewing the Sony ZV-1F camera. So stay tuned, you don't wanna miss it. Okay y'all, so here's the ZV-1F from Sony. This is the newer model that just came out last, well, in October. But I'm gonna give y'all my honest review of it. I've had it for a month now. So let's see what's going on with it. So, you know, you can take off the lens and only thing, this don't have a retractable lens. So you, this is all you get really. So the zooming is not all that great, um, to be honest with you. If I could, I would have bought a better camera that I could change the lens out. If I could do other things and zoom in more closer to faraway objects. But for the most part, this is a great content creator camera for beginners. So I got the white one because I wanted to do something different. Um, as you see, got the little fuzzy ball on top. So let's start it up and see what's going on with it. As you can see, got the fuel finder and you can turn it. Oops, I think I started recording. I don't wanna record on here. No, I didn't start recording, that's good. I might've took a picture though. But you can see you can turn it different ways so you can look at it. So if you're looking at it in the front of you, you can see what's going on, as you can see, you know. Um, for the most part, this is a very good camera. The door shuts nice. It's not loose and wobbly, so it's good, good sturdy camera. I'm not going to lie to you. Um, I do use it a lot. This is the first day I'm not using it. Since I got it, I'm recording on my iPhone 11 to make this video review. As you see the buttons, this right here will zoom in and zoom out. Let me see if I can help you out with that. I'm gonna show y'all this way. See, I'm zooming in, let's zoom out. Then we got your record button. You got your autofocus. Oh, well, this might be the autofocus too. Then you got, if you wanna take pictures, you could just take pictures by pushing this button right here. Um, let's take this off real quick. Let's sit right here. You got your, your mic right here. It's a very good mic. Cut down a lot of wind. So this is the camera. Um, you still got your jack ports over here where you can plug a mic up, but you don't really have to. This camera is very good without a mic. Um, USB cords, your HDMI cords go here. Your settings and it's touch screen. That's what I do like about it is touch screen. So, you know, you can touch on it and do whatever you need to do. Auto focus is great on this camera. So, let's open it up. Let's get to the back of it. The back of it, you got your dial right here where you can turn it and get to different settings. You know, you got your trash. You got little different things. You could program it to hit one button and it, it'll go to whatever you want. I mean, this is a very good camera, you know? You see, I'm changing down here, so it's changing it to wherever you need it to be. You got your trash, you got your thing. See, I took a picture, I don't even know what, what video that was, but you wanna get back out of there. So I like it and it's very small. See, it fits right in the, like the palm of my hand. It's 
very small so when you're out there creating it won't be so noticeable like one of the bigger cameras it's not heavy at all it's very lightweight where your arms not gonna get tired if you're putting it on a tripod and carrying it around so i mean i really like this camera you know here's the power button so you could power it off see it turned off now you know flip it back around close it so therefore you know your screen don't get messed up while you transporting it around so it's a good cover up you know like i said this is a wind reflector cuts out the wind so when you doing your videos or whatever and you outside and it's kind of breezy it'll muffle that sound out so you can speak clearly into it I mean, I really like this camera a whole lot. And I got it um, when it first came out. Actually, I bought it before it came out, but the release date was October 24th. So I've been playing around with it, going through the settings, but you really don't have to go through the settings really, because it comes already set up for you. So you can start playing with it out the box. But, you know, I go through the little settings because I want my stuff to be crispy for y'all. Um, lens cap is good so you don't touch your lens and get it dirty. Um, just snap it in, actually. Um, you got these two little things right here. You push them and they're releasing clamp on. So when you hold it, you're putting it down like this. It's not going to mess up nothing. I mean, I really like it. I got the little hand strap. I took this from off another camera I had that I got from my nephew um, and put it on here. But you don't really have to have it, you know. Just put it on the tripod and go. But curious which one of y'all love to buy one of these and what would you do with it? Leave a comment, like, comment, and subscribe if you like the video. Give it a thumbs down if you don't. But this is my product review. I give it two thumbs up. Definitely. Um, yeah, that's about it. That's about it for it. I mean, it's a beautiful camera. It comes in black too if you want black. I chose white. I buy everything black, you know. And I said in my last video, I seen um, CJ So Cool, he had one, and it was a white one, so I wanted to get a white one because I like the way it looked, you know. I always have everything black, so I had bought this one. Oh, yeah. And um, here's where you'll put the tripod at. You see it's right there. So the good thing about this camera over the Sony ZV-1 is that this one, the screw for the, the tripod is over here. So while it's over here, you still can access your battery. You don't have to remove it all the time for quick change of battery or put another SIM card in. So that's good. That is easy access change out without having to take everything off and all that but I definitely like it um yeah the Sony ZV-1F is definitely a great buy so I would say get it you won't be disappointed I'll talk to y'all later peace some extra clips in so you could get a 360 degree on how the camera look close up in hand also I have some pictures in there so yeah don't forget to like comment and subscribe I'm trying to grow my channel maybe at a thousand subscribers I'm gonna do a giveaway
time I'ma live up Head down